everyone. So today's video is going to be about confidence. Um, having confidence in yourself. And really, what does confidence mean? To me, it means just feeling good about yourself. Feeling that you can do something. And feeling that you don't care what people think. So really, it's hard to feel like that. Because, you know, even if you say you don't care what people think, to some extent, I think that you do. Like, I can say, you know, I don't care. I don't care what they think. But honestly, I do, you know, you care what people think. And I didn't have confidence for a long time. I didn't have really great confidence. But now I feel like my confidence in myself is better. Like, I feel like I can do anything that I want to do. And I feel like if you want to do something, you should just do it. Like, really, you have to think in your mind, I don't care. You have to master that thought. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. If you want to wear an outfit that you think is cute, I mean, wear it. If somebody's going to sit there and judge you and say you shouldn't wear it, just be like, I don't care. I want to wear it. I'm going to wear it. If you want to go and go to school for something that everyone else thinks is stupid, do it. You know, I don't care what you think. This is my life. I'm the one who has to live with my decisions. I'm going to do it. And if you, you really just have to think that. If somebody's going to sit there and talk about you, you have to say, I don't care. Everybody's always going to have something to say. Everybody's always going to have something bad to say, good to say, judge you, talk about you. Always, always, always. That's never not going to happen. So you have to just deal with it and say, I don't care. Brush it off completely. Like, in my class, I was never confident. I was never out to talk loudly about anything or just talk in general. And now I feel like when I go back to school, I am going to be such a different person and they will see me so much more because I am so much more confident now to just come out of my shell, show who I am, be who I am and not care about what they think about me. Like I never wanted to talk because they might think, oh, what she says is stupid or what she says doesn't matter or, you know, that outfit she's not wearing is cute or she's dumb for saying that or she's weird. Like, why does she think that? You know what? Who cares? Somebody in that room is going to respect me. Somebody in that room is going to like what I have to say. And if they don't, who cares? Somebody else does. Who cares if nobody likes what I say? If I think it's right, then who cares? Really, you have to think that. If you want to date somebody and somebody's not okay with it, who cares? Honestly, you only have to live with your decisions. You, at the end of the day, why did I just do this? <laughs> but really, do what you want to do and what's going to make you happy no matter what. Like if there is a question in the classroom, uh, if I would answer it, I'd be like, I'd be afraid if my answer is wrong. I'd be afraid if I didn't speak loud enough. I'd be afraid if somebody else would think, oh my gosh, she talked or, you know, but now I don't care. If I know the answer, I'm going to say the answer. I'm going to raise my hand or say it. I'm going to talk loud enough. Somebody's like, oh my gosh, she talked. I'd be like, yeah, I did because I wanted to, you know? Like, you just have to get to that point where you don't care what people think. If you're going to wear an outfit and someone's like... Well, that, that looks weird and that's not personally messed up. I'll be like, I don't care. I like it. I'm going to wear it. You wear what you want to wear and that's it. You don't need to be in my business. Like, honestly. <laughs> like, you just need to not care so much because I think what holds us back so much is what people think about us or what we think about ourselves. Because if you think, I don't look good, I'm so fat, I'll never look like this girl, you can't compare yourself to people. That will tear you down because you are never going to be look like that person you compare yourself to. You never will. I mean, you might if you get tons and tons of plastic surgery, but then you wouldn't be you. You'd be a copy of them, which is not good. You know, you don't want to be a copy of somebody. You are the way you are because of a reason, so you need to embrace it. If you don't like your shape, or the, you're stuck with that shape, but if you don't like, you know how much body fat you have or whatever, you know, do something about it. Don't sit there and complain if you're not going to do something about it. You need to do, if you're passionate enough about changing the way you look, then you're going to do whatever it takes. So don't sit there and complain about the results you're not getting if you're not putting in any work to do it. So that's changeable. If you think that you are not a people person or you are too shy, get out there and change it because you're never going to change unless you make yourself change. Nobody else is going to make you change. You have to make yourself change. So if you want to be more of a people person, if you want to be less shy, get out there, talk to people, put yourselves in positions where you have to talk to people. Just do it. And I really think 
that I would never be in this situation to talk about this if it hadn't been for YouTube and cosmetology school because and people that I met along the way that have inspired me to just be like you know what who really cares who cares not me I don't care and <clears throat> I just feel like you need to take chances in your life and just do it just take chances and do it I mean honestly if you don't like the way your hair is, the color, change the color. If you don't like the length, you can get it cut shorter. You can let it grow out. Until then, you have to find some way to make it cute and do the processor. If you just don't like something about yourself, change it. I mean, what else? You're going to stay like that forever and feel bad about it? No. You're going to think, what can I do to fix this? And then you're going to try your best to fix it. Because if you never do something about it, it's never going to change. You are the only one who can make it change. You can change it today. You can start changing it today. Some things don't happen overnight. But you can start changing it today because you're not getting any younger. And if that's what it's going to take for you to feel better about yourself, for you to be able to step out there and say, you know what, I can do this and I don't care what you think, then do it. Because by all means, you don't need to sit back and just let yourself feel that way. You know, you need to get out and you need to take opportunities and just do things in your life. Just do them. Just do it. Okay, now I'm sounding like Nike. But honestly, like I think I've come such a long way and that really makes me happy that I'm growing as a person. Because if you saw me in kindergarten and you saw me now, obviously I've grown in size. But in kindergarten I was like a silent little baby. Silent. Like, in preschool, I would not talk to you, and I would cry and cry and cry for my parents. I hated preschool, and my mom took me out of it because I was just so antisocial. In kindergarten, I cried so, so much. They didn't even know where I was. I was crying on a bench. Okay? My mom had to work at the school my whole elementary school because I had, like, separation anxiety. One time we had a substitute teacher. I was too shy to ask to go to the bathroom that I peed on myself. Honestly, we had a sub. I wasn't comfortable with that sub. And I think I started crying and I just peed because I was too scared to ask her to go to the bathroom. And this girl was like, Tabitha was peeing and my mom had to come. But honestly, like, that person is so much different from who I am today. If I had to go to the bathroom, I'd just be like, I need to use the restroom and I would go. But back then, no. And you know, if you want to get to a point in your life where you can be like that, you will get to it. I never thought that I would be able to sit there and say this, but things happen, things change, and you can honestly do it. If you have a goal to do it, you can do it. You're never going to get it if you don't start trying. Unless you're happy with the way you are, then just be happy about it. No one's forcing you to change, but if you want to change, don't sit around and complain about it. Just do it. And... This video was supposed to be about confidence. I guess it is about confidence. But to feel confident about yourself, you just have to like yourself first before other people can see that in you. Because if you are constantly moping around like, I'm not good enough and I'm so ugly and no one's ever going to like me and I'm never going to get a girlfriend. Of course nobody wants to be around you. Nobody wants to date you. If you're going to be like that. Nobody wants to constantly be having to give you compliments to feel good about yourself. Oh, look, you're not, you're not, you're not. No. They want to be like, you know what? Change it. Don't feel sorry for yourself. Don't sit there feel sorry for yourself. Just get up. Improve what you want to improve. So that you can feel like, you know what? I'm good enough. I feel confident about my looks. About my abilities. I can do anything that I want to do. I don't care about you I don't care what you think and you don't also want to be dependent on someone else you don't want to feel like you always have to have someone because really all you have is yourself someone's not always going to be there I mean you know you have family but in some cases family's not even going to be there you always only have yourself so you need to be comfortable with yourself you need to love yourself you need to feel like you can do whatever you want to do and you just need to do that so you can just feel like if somebody's going to walk out on you, you can be like, I don't need you. If somebody's going to judge you, you can be like, I don't care what you think because I think that I am good enough or that I look good, you know? You need to not let people's opinions get to you. If somebody's going to sit there and say this video is stupid and that I'm stupid and that I'm ugly, of course I'm going to be like, well, what, why would they think that? 
you know, I didn't do anything that I thought was stupid or ugly, but then I'm going to be like, you know what? Who cares? I'm not going to change their opinion by arguing with them. So, honestly, don't care about people's opinions. If you want to change something, do it. It's very motivational. It says, three simple rules in life. If you do not go after what you want, you'll never have it. If you do not ask, the answer will always be no. And if you do not step forward, you will always be in the same place. Words to live by, people. Words to live by. I'm sorry if you seem like an angry preacher in this video. But honestly, I just want you guys to feel good about yourselves. <laughs> do what you want to do. And don't let people sit there and make you feel bad about yourself. Don't. Don't let them do that to you. You have so much that you can be doing. But really, I guess that's it, you guys. Let me know what you think about this video. Leave comments below. Message me. Whatever. I want to talk to you. I want you to talk to me. And let me see your thoughts on this video. If you hate it, if you love it. Whatever. Maybe if somebody needs this advice, you can send this to them. And be like, look, you need this advice in your life. You need it. But I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye.